it nice and cool with this. It's the middle of winter in this country and it's so hot. The only way to keep cool is to stay outside. Babe, stop, I've got something for you, come. I found this on Osborg, it was only $39. Let's see how this cheap tower fan compares to that expensive noisy Dyson. This is the cheapest tower fan, fan I could find on Osbargain. Let's unbox this and see how this compares to a proper Dyson AM07 fan. And to help with this unboxing, I have my professional boxer unboxer. Please, can I introduce? Okay, I'm not an abusive husband, okay? That was an accident. <laughs> Let's do this, guys. <laughs> it's a girl. No, oh, it's definitely a boy. What's up? <laughs> All right, so inside the box, we have stands. We have. A remote, a remote. That's all. It comes with a remote. Oh, oh my God, it's with a remote. That's really awesome. So on the back of the fan, there's a double dot over here. And there's one of these that has a double dot. So you just do the double dot with the double dot. Oh, so. yeah. Yeah, isn't it? Oh, okay. Yeah. We're making progress. Plugging him in. <laughs> Looks all right. He's plugged in right now. I'm really excited because I need some power. I need some air. Huh? Oh, it's blowing the camera away. Oh, is it really? Yeah. Oh, it's nice, Ash. Oh, my God, it's really nice. Whoa. You know, I think it's stronger than the Dyson. It feels strong. It's, it's noisy, but to be honest, for that price, oh, it's really nice. So cooling. This is exactly. Oh, why did you stop? Oh, sorry. <laughs> this is exactly what I need after a hot winter's day here in Aussie Wazzy. Scott. Oh. oh, it's nice, isn't it? It's really nice. You're going to enjoy this in your room. You're going to really enjoy it. We've been testing this out for literally two minutes. Two minutes. And we've already come up with the conclusion. <laughs> it's great. Okay, yeah. It's only three settings, so it's um, low, medium, and high. It'd be better if there were six, but for the price, I'm not going to complain. And it oscillates, so it turns around. You can have an oscillating mode if you don't want it just to be in your face. The power seems really good, but the best thing about this is the noise sounds more natural than the Dyson. All right, so this is a quick comparison on how different fans sound when they're on max performance mode. The Dyson fan sounds like a big, like, ah, like a, a, vacuum a turbine, yeah, like a vacuum cleaner. Whereas this sounds like a fan, like which a is fan. fine. Yeah. And for the price that we got it for, I can't really fault this thing. And with fans, you're used to that noise, so your brain can tune it out. But with new noises, it's just a bit disturbing. So for the price, obviously. It does feel a bit flimsy. Yeah, yeah. But, you know, you're not going to, like, knock it around. But it's black. It looks good. You know, I'm not going to, pay $39, my friend. Good going, good going. Get this cheap fan. Although, sure. although something, mm. too noisy for the bedroom? Probably. Yeah, too noisy. It's lower setting. It's probably yeah. equivalent to the three on the Dyson. Probably. Yeah, yeah. So three or four on the Dyson. But it feels cooler than the Dyson. Yeah, it feels like it's actually working. The Dyson. Something. Yeah, that's what it was. Yeah. The Dyson was just the, the name Dyson. It wasn't exactly the thing about the Dyson. Even though it said cool, it wasn't actually cooling it air. Hot. It was just whatever the air was hot. around. Yeah. It didn't actually do anything. Okay guys, stay tuned, hit the like, subscribe and share button and if you've got any comments about this tower fan, if you've experienced it, let us know. And if you know a better tower fan, let us know because summer is coming. This is the middle of winter and it's so friggin' hot. Ah, love it. Ah.